Okay, check it out. As promised, I've got the 210 stacked on top of the 115 HLF, and together these guys give me a 4 ohm load. Remember, two 8 ohm boxes wired in parallel will yield you a 4 ohm load. Now, I get asked this quite a bit actually. What's the best way to run two cabinets from a head? Run separate speaker routes from the head into each cabinet, or run one speaker out to one cabinet and then daisy chain that cabinet to the next? Either way is absolutely fine. Either way will yield you, in this case, will yield you a 4 ohm load. Um, I'm of the thought that Murphy's Law always comes into account. If you wire one output to one cabinet and then wire that cabinet to the other cabinet, should anything happen to that connection going from the head to the first cabinet, you lose your entire rig. If you run two speaker routes, one to each cabinet, should you lose one connection to one cabinet, you still have the second cabinet running. So that's just my belief. Either way works perfectly fine. Um, so with this rig, I've got one speaker out going to the 210 HLF, or actually one speaker out going to the 115 HLF, then daisy chaining up to the 210. Either way is fine. It doesn't matter how you run it. But... Now, the beauty of this rig, too, with the 210 on top, is you can run it just like this, or should you choose, you can still utilize the monitor feature on the 210 and tilt it back so that it's still firing up at you. And this is right in my face. So, literally, I've got that cabinet blowing right at me. So now the 210 becomes my personal monitor, and then the 115 becomes the cabinet that's going to shake the entire room. So, if I put it back, and they're lightweight enough that you can handle them with one hand, I've got a killer rig that I can use in just about any gigging situation. Outdoor stages, indoor stages, it really doesn't matter. This is a great rig for just about anybody. And then you can use either cab separately or combine them. Next, we're going to set up the 410 HLF on top of the 115 HLF, and that's just the ultimate killer rig. You can use that anywhere. So check this out. Okay, as promised, the ultimate concert rig, the 410 HLF on top of the 115 HLF. It doesn't get any more booty shaking than that. Uh, this is the ultimate rig, guys. Um, what can I say? Either cabinet alone is a great, great, great standalone cabinet. You combine the two and you've got an absolute monster rig. Right now I'm powering it with an SVT7 Pro. Uh, you can bi -amp it with a 4 Pro, you can run it with a 3 Pro, you can run it with a 2 Pro. This rig will run with just about any one of our Pro Series heads, uh, as well as any one of our Classic Series heads. It is a killer rig. Um, the only thing probably better than this, maybe two of them, side by side, powered with an 8 Pro. Well, I hope this video certainly gives you plenty of insight on the Pro Neo Series. Just to recap a couple of things. Custom-made Eminence Neodymium drivers, Eminence APT50 high-frequency horn driver, 15mm birch, 
They're lightweight, they're rugged, they're portable, they're high performance, they're high power. And last but not least, these guys are designed and assembled here in the USA. So go out, check them out. You owe it to yourself to go check these out in the store. This video is a great starting point for you to get a reference as to what goes into the cabinets. But I recommend you going out and hearing them for yourselves. Uh, I